Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to set a new voicemail number on the I keep saying I want to say it on a specific device. So this tutorial is basically going to show you how to set up a uh, new voicemail number on any Android smartphone. So the voicemail is used when you can't answer a call. So someone will call you, you can't get through and they'll be able to leave you a message. Now, depending on your SIM card, you may not actually have a voicemail uh, set up by default. Now, what your phone will try and do is if someone calls you, it will just ring out and it will ring and it will ring and it will ring until the other person hangs up or you answer or dismiss the call. This is vital that you set a um, new number or set a voicemail number. Now, in some cases, uh, you may find that the best place to do it is through your um, your own network's voicemail service, which you can Google online and you can look, basically type in, you know, freeze voicemail service, you can EE's voicemail service or wherever you are in the world, you can look for their own voicemail service number, which you can then add to this menu I'm about to show you and gives you the option of at least having a voicemail. So then if you think you've got a missed call and they've left the message, you could phone the service number and uh, listen to your message. To do this, you're going to be opening up the phone app and you're going to be looking for the settings menu. This will always be in the top right of the app. And from there, you're going to look for the answer, uh, sorry, you're going to be looking for the voicemail settings option. Now, this may be called voicemail provider, something similar, uh, but you'll get the gist. From there, you'll have a voicemail number. So as you can see, my number is set to uh, freeze uh, voicemail service at the moment. So I... When people call and I can't answer a call, it will go to this number and they'll be able to leave an answering machine message or voicemail as shown. But you can change this number. So in your case, you may have an empty number. So you can obviously skip this and you can enter the number that's provided on um, the site that's related to your network. Or if you've got a secondary smartphone that you want to set up as your answering machine, again, put it there and uh, it will save it. Once you're done, press OK and it will save that number for you. And that's how you set a new voicemail number on any Android smartphone. Thanks for watching.